In my belly, Yana, tattoo my man name, then give him some Becky Yana. 85 comma plus three zeros, plus another comma plus three zeros. Then add a dot, bop a dot dot, bop a dot dot do. <laughs> hey y'all, okay, so I'm just gonna tell y'all how to basically start your own lash business, find your vendors, packaging, how much it'll cost, the quality of lashes, and all of that. So stay tuned. I have a list of things that I wrote down. You can't see it because the focus is off. But basically, it's a list of how to find your vendors. Okay, so first, what I did is I found my vendors actually through Instagram. Like, I literally scrolled through Instagram, typed in um, 25 millimeter lashes or 3D minks or, or lash wholesale. I put that in the search box and I just searched up my vendor and I was like okay cool they got some nice little pictures or whatever whatever they had good quality lashes and I looked at the video so I was like okay cool so with most of the vendors you're gonna make sure that you have good quality lashes so I'm gonna show y'all pictures of the lashes that I sell which is called bun bait bundles and minks and also i have because bun bait is my brand this is one of the designs in classic minks that i sell There's, okay so you're gonna need to ask your once you already get a vendor you're gonna need to ask them these things so i need y'all to, to get a list and write these down you're gonna need to figure out the quality. What kind of quality do you want? They have either sink, silk, they either have silk, full mink, or like 100% mink lashes. I went with minks. So you just would ask them which one of you prefer. The price that I pay for my lashes is about, let's just say it's two to four dollars a piece per lash and yes you can get lashes cheaper on aliexpress i know everybody like and you can get cheaper on aliexpress okay well go on aliexpress wait a month then come back and tell me how y'all feel about it because i mean yeah people are gonna wait a month but it's fine and there's nothing wrong with aliexpress lashes like i love aliexpress but my vendor is not on aliexpress so, you're going to need to know that these vendors are coming from China, okay? The shipping is going to be like two to four days at the most, like, and I get like packages like these. I have a lot of junk in there, but they'll send it in boxes or whatever, but it comes pretty fast for me. Like, I like it. I don't have to wait a whole week or whatever to get it. And with shipping, the price is going to depend on how much lashes you get. So, if you're getting packaging and lashes, it's going to be about, like, 30 to $50 already for shipping. So, don't get discouraged about the shipping price because that's normal. That's how much it's going to be. So, just get with it. This package I have for my brand and it's a gold open up magnetic this is empty right now but that's fine i'm gonna show you the other one that got a lash in here whatever and also you do need to download you do need to download the WhatsApp. The WhatsApp is basically like a messaging app and you can basically connect with different vendors. They'll be like, hey, like for instance, go on Instagram, type in, type in the 25 millimeter or 3D Minx search bar and then DM them be like, hey, can I message you on WhatsApp? Cause like with WhatsApp, that's what they use in China. And it's gonna be more convenient to not only them, but it's going to be more convenient to you because they can send you videos of the quality of the lashes. They can send you 
information that gives you a catalog. And a catalog is basically a whole spread sheet of just so much lashes you can pick, pick from what I was talking about earlier. When a vendor has a MOQ, okay, you're gonna see MOQ a lot. MOQ, what's MOQ? MOQ, you better get used to because a lot of these vendors can be like, okay, MOQ 20, MOQ 50, MOQ 100. I hate when vendors be like, MOQ 500. I'll be like, 500? Like, basically, that's, you can only have a minimum of 500. Let's say you're trying to order lash, let's say you're trying to order packaging. MOQ 500. What? I gotta buy 500 of these just to place order. Plus pay for almost $100 shipping. Shipping already over 100 if it's already 500. So I'm pretty sure of it. Like that's high. Like for like with my vendor, it's no MOQ. You can order one lash, two lash, five lash, 10 lash. But guess what? The shipping is always gonna be like the lowest shipping rate is $35 that I've paid. The highest I've paid probably like 16 next thing you're gonna want to do is order samples I'm telling you this you have to order samples because if you don't order samples and you get them cheap lashes don't say I told you so okay. but my vendor be giving me samples all the time these are what the samples they gave me which is these lashes, but they are really, 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 like, dramatic. And I was gonna wear dramatic lashes for this video, but I was like, I'm kinda over the 25 millimeter wave or whatever, cause, like, I still like it, but yeah. I'm gonna take this off and show you my lashes. These are minks, okay? Okay. 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 So, with payments, listen up, y'all. Please listen up. Payments. I don't really trust Western Union because I know sometimes people be using it for like for like scam and stuff. So I don't really be using uh, Western Union like that. The only thing payment my vendor be asking for me is either PayPal or Ali Alibaba. Alibaba. That's the website where most vendors are from or on or AliExpress. So Alibaba or PayPal payments. And that's the only thing I would recommend. The other ones, I'm not, I'm not too much sure. But you can send money at your own risk to China. And yeah. Okay, so. When looking for vendors, you also want to make sure the person is reliable and the person is always active. Especially on... Especially in the WhatsApp, like, because it shows, like, when the last time the person has been, like, online. So, that's what I like about the WhatsApp. And they will spam you, I'm not gonna lie. They gonna send you all type of sales. They gonna, them Chinese people be on it. They be on it. Like, they know when I sell, when we be having, like, the little tax tree sales. They know, of course, they know all of our holidays and stuff. So, that's when most of the products are gonna be cheaper online. So, they can order in a bulk. When you getting all your information for your lashes, you don't wanna half-ass do stuff like you don't want to just put out bad products and try to rush your launch and all of that because for me it took some time i had to find some i had to basically get a domain you have to also get a business license i'm still yet finalizing with a lot of things you have to get like a ein number but i will only recommend getting a business license and EIN number once you get once you really know that you're serious with it because that would be a waste of time and also you have to worry about the packaging because packaging is going to cost shipping is going to cost people are going to be up your necks talking about why this and that cost what like people don't know how what it is to run try to run your own business and see me I'm in college so I be on a budget like I'm cheap as fuck cheap as hell so I like to find the cheap way out of shit and like with the packaging and stuff I wish I had like a Maryland thing to show y'all but like 
Sometimes I wrap my lashes with this paper. That's wrapping paper. You can get that from Dollar Store for a dollar, or you can buy them both. Also get these. Okay, I send this, but sometimes my orders when I don't have my boxes, I will usually send out these, and I just literally get the lash, put it in. And then I'll get like a business card, put it in that too, seal it up, and then ship it out. Okay, so I know y'all seen this, but this is a flower pot that a lot of people are selling now. And basically it comes with seven pairs of lashes, so it's like a lash right here, right here, right here, right here. And seven in total. And these, like from the vendors, they are like really cheap, like they're really expensive. All you gotta do is just ask if they have this. Another box packaging I got was this, like when I started off, I'm still gonna be using it, but I got this. It's pink. Cute, flirty, and well, I had the a style in there, but it's empty. But this is how it looks, and then it just has this little string thing you could pull off. Thank you. Well, you I guess you gotta leave it out and then put the lash thing on there. But it'd be like acting all stupid, but this is also one of the cases that I use and. I think the minimum, the, the MOQ for this was 50. And the MOQ for the silver glitter boxes was, um, is nothing, I guess, because it's always in stock. So, yeah. Also with packaging, I'm gonna let y'all in a little secret. Well, not a secret, but I get my stickers off Etsy, Etsy. And these are my stickers. These are my stickers and I just put these stickers on top of my box but um, you can also get stickers from like Staples or any store that sells crafty things well office supplies sorry my head is like fucked up I also use like the bubble packaging wrappers like a lot of people got customized wrappers but I did honestly, I don't even know why I got this, but I picked this up from the dollar store. And this is what I ship off my smaller stuff in. See, I could ship off like one or two lashes in this or like one pomade. So, yeah. You can get these off of Amazon or you can also get it off like Walmart.com or even the Walmart stores or Dollar Tree, Dollar General. But my family actually recently just bought me a bulk of envelopes. So shout out to them because I don't have to buy it for a while. Like, I can just chill out, save my own money. And save they and spend and make money. Seriously, you really have to be patient. Be heavy. On, be very heavy on, on advertisement. I'm so heavy on my advertisement that it makes no sense. Like, I would literally spam up my whole social media. I'll spam up Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest. I pass out cards. The marketplace on Facebook is really good. You can sell stuff. Snapchat, what, what else am I missing? Like, if you have any type of social media platform, you should be using all of it, period, to be promoting your lashes. And lashes sell quick. Like, you can sell lashes for 10 bucks. You can sell lashes for $15, $20. Like, it's all, it's up to, like, your following and how much people you follow, how much you think you're gonna sell. Like, I'm so serious, y'all. Like, I love selling lashes, but at the same time, it does become hectic because, I get discouraged just the simple fact that sometimes I feel like unappreciated like but yeah honestly I just get a notebook when I'm feeling down I get a notebook write all of my ideas and my thoughts down and just kind of take a step one by one to like trying to achieve my goals the vast I have a whole, I have so much notebooks and stuff. Also, 
if y'all want me to talk about um also if y'all want me to talk about how to make like my graphic flyers and stuff once you go on my page you'll see what i'm talking about but i make that from the app i can screenshot it i can like really record i can screen record it one day and show y'all how i make it if y'all want me to do it or just any other questions y'all can just leave it down below remember to sample Cause you don't want no plastic lashes you want mink lashes not plastic lashes because there are many people out there who are selling mink well who are selling plastic lashes like literally the lashes have it's just it's just plastic like and uh, the e-commercial platform that I use is Big Cartel. I love Big Cartel because I can really just see everything. Like I can see what time what time people visited or it'll show you like the details and the visitors, how much money you made per day or um, in a week, in a year all together you could also track shipping on there and i got the 999 plan for b cartel just for the simple fact that i don't really need anything bigger and i got the 999 plan because um you can add up to 20 or 30 items i think or 25 but i'm at my limit right now okay but I be deleting stuff because like i'll just be switching around stuff or whatever and it's easy to play with like so i'm gonna be with shopify but honestly i'm gonna just stick with the big cartel for now because i don't have time i already bought my domain from godaddy get a domain from godaddy that's like less than 15 bucks you'll be good to go because you don't want it to be like um lashes by lena dot big cartel dot com like it'll look more professional it'll look more professional if you have like a, a dot com at the end of your website so yeah i think i covered like most of the important stuff like i don't want to go too much into details i can make maybe a part two video or i could just show y'all how i like package up stuff with like the like these and where to order it from and the packaging and what to find out and all of that i can do that for y'all and also i can do the logos so y'all just gotta let me know y'all just gotta let me know i'm i'll be busy but listen here y'all y'all gotta bear with me y'all gotta bear with me I spent over thousands and thousands of dollars investing in my vendor like i'm not just about to give you my vendor but you can't go on alibaba or i think it's how you pronounce it or aliexpress or instagram like i said to find a vendor because it's not hard people make it hard and it's not hard Okay, so thank y'all so much for watching my video if it was helpful just leave me a thumbs up comment down below what i missed or what y'all want me to talk about in the next video or just dm me ask me questions if you want to ask privately and add me on all social medias okay okay